Hello, my name is Kyle Bassett. I'm here at the Venetia Wind, Wind Energy Research Center. Uh, today I'll be doing an experiment with an axial flux alternator that we just finished building. Uh, the way this works is that there's two magnet disks mounted along a spindle hub. One of them is a north pole, the other one is a south pole, and they alternate around, so there's a strong magnetic attraction between the disks. In between here is what's known as a stator. It's filled with nine coils with 110 turns of 16 gauge magnet wire. Now right now they're just connected simply for an experiment in a star connection. And a lot of people are very interested about how to make a low RPM generator for wind turbines, hydro generators, all sorts of renewable energy. Now this is an example of a low RPM generator that you can make yourself using simple tools and simple materials. And with that, you can generate renewable electricity. So right now I just want to show what the cut-in RPM would be for a 12 volt battery. So we have our star connection coming into a three-phase rectifier. This three-phase rectifier is then going to a simple multimeter reading voltage. And right here we have a tachometer so we can see the RPM that we're operating at. So this is uh, the cut-in speed, the speed at which the, uh, the alternator reaches 12 volts is a very important variable when it comes to renewable energy utilization. And so this is a very low RPM generator, as you'll see in a second. So I'm just going to spin this by hand, slowly. You can watch the voltage and revolutions per minute. So you see here we're at about 47 RPM, 15 volts. I'll slow down a little bit to see what our cut-in is. We're at about 13.7, around 45 RPM. So, this thing will start charging 12 volt batteries at around 38, 39 RPM.